A very warm welcome to the learning home. In this video, we are going to discuss uh, what is task scheduler in Windows 10. So this is this uh, feature is uh, primarily used when we want to open a specific uh, program or send a message reminder or uh, send a kind of email on specific time. In that case, this uh, feature is very, very useful. So uh, like uh, at certain time, like, uh, you know, at one specific time, I'd like to open a certain uh, website so I can use this feature. If I had to send an email at a specific time, I can use this feature without any intervention. The system will send the email. Uh, we can uh, ask the computer to give us a reminder at a specific time. Uh, in that way also, it is very useful. So uh, let's start with the search bar and we will search the task scheduler. And when you click it here, we will go to the task scheduler library. And uh, here is the two options, create basic task and create task. So we will use the create task because create basic task is basic in nature and it's kind of subset of uh, create task. So let's explore create task. So you will see a box has opened over here. And uh, so imagine I'm trying to show you that uh, how we can open a website at a specific time. So I'm going to name it. You can name it as per your preference and uh, we can give some kind of name and description. And here is two options. One is the run only when the user is logged on and uh, run whether the user is logged on or not. So these words uh, is quite clear that uh, if we want to run this uh, task, if I'm logged in or uh, I want to run it even if I'm not logged into the system. So this is the ch chosen uh, option is uh, good enough for me. So now we'll move to the second tab that is triggers and triggers the word itself says uh, what is going to trigger the action. So I'm going to set the trigger by clicking new and I want this to open uh, we can set a there uh, set a uh, trigger daily weekly or monthly apart from that there is option called begin the task and there is option called on a schedule at log on startup on an event and there are multiple options which we all can choose based on our preference and convenience so for me on a schedule is perfectly fine and I'm going to choose uh, daily and uh, at 11.55 I want to open the one specific website and uh, we can also delay the task to a random delay we can delay the task by uh, uh, whatever preferred hours we can also uh, ask ask the system to run this task at regular interval like repeat it at every one hour and for a duration of hours or a day whatever we, we ask for uh, so this is all about the triggers and uh, we will click ok and the third one is that we have set the trigger now what is the action so uh, action is at this trigger point I'm asking computer to open a website so I will create the task and for that one I will go to the program and script uh, before that we have three options what I've said earlier one is the starter program uh, send an email or send a message so these are the three options we have so at the moment we are trying to open a website so we will use the starter program first and then we will browse what the browser we want to open so I'm going to use uh, Google Chrome here so I'm going to define the path where the Google Chrome is kept so I'm just open it here and imagine I'm going to open observer voice and click OK we can also uh, open add a new new if you want to open it so again we'll go to the google chrome and imagine we want to open 
YouTube and again same thing okay and we want to add as many uh, program there are another tab called conditions and uh, in this one uh, there is another option like start the task only if the computer is idle for certain minutes or hours uh, this this uh, description is good enough to say what this uh, feature is asking for again if you want to run the computer when the computer is powered with the ac power or if it is in the battery mode we can limit there is another option that if you want this task to run when it is connected to a specific network connection then we can uh, choose this network option and uh, uh, control when and how this uh, task is going to be triggered setting is more or less similar let it be like this i don't want to change anything here and i will click ok and that is all we have set for the task to run so here <clears throat> at every uh, at 11:55, this will open uh, the ta this task scheduler will open to the website, and uh, it will run at every every hours. That's what we have said. So I'm going to show you that how it is going to run. So I'm going to click this run, and you will see the Google Chrome has opened here, and it has opened this uh, website but you may have noticed that another website has not opened so this is sometimes uh, it happens like uh, now we have opened this website and if you run it then it will run open both so you have seen the observer voice is opened here and observer voice again opened and then this is it youtube so this is how the task scheduler work and i hope that it has given you a little insight in case you find it interesting please do like and share for similar videos please do subscribe and press the bell icon so that you will be notified about the future videos for any new topics please do write in the comment section i will cover it in the future videos and with this goodbye and hope to see you soon